Life Time here on the MCF Time channel, presenting you with a little bit more of that Game Dev Tycoon. Um, I need you to do some research really quickly. Uh, no, not school. We're gonna do space. I feel like there's... Okay, that's level editor. I don't... I don't know. I, I'm pretty sure that'll have to do with the engine, to be honest, but... Is she doing her one training? Okay, her technology is really bad. Man, jeez. Okay, I think she's still doing that other thing. Complete. He needs to go on a vacation real quick. Okay, and then... Did we do the report? Okay, so let's see what kind of... Let's do a contract work real quick. Make a quick buck. Ooh! Like vacuum robot create a revolutionary AI for a vacuum robot. Um, okay. Okay, let's do that. <clears throat> uh oh. Probably shouldn't put the guy on vacation. So just waiting for him. I'm still waiting for her. Would hire again. We will. Okay. Then let's do another. No, nope, not that. Over here. Find uh, contract work. I like that. I like that we're having some more advances. I'm just gonna go for it. I know I can do it. We got all four of us on it now. No problem. We're just stepping into vacuum stuff. Um, this is our booth and better location. We should expect more visitors with this booth and have space to give away. Had to golf. It isn't very large booth. <clears throat> Let's just go up medium booth. There you go. I guess I could not participate too, huh? I'll instantly make it back to two mil, maybe not. I like the self-publish. I mean, I like the idea of working for yourself, but uh, you know, maybe maybe you can't always do that. You know, I definitely want to make one for the Eve there, the Super Ness. I don't want to make a um, mystery genre. I want to make space. So you know what? Scroll. You guess. We're done. We'll transfer 62k to your account. Thank you. Um, do I have anything else to research, really? No. So let's just build our game. Oh, look, I want to see what the thing I got. Okay, so it's level editor. Who thinks? Appreciate. It. I think level editor. It's like create your own level kind of thing. Maybe, but maybe it's not. Create custom engine. No, the new game. Pick topic. Space. This is, good. this is easy. Too easy right here. Time and space. The game. Okay. This is not capital is the. Thank you. Time and space. I think space is for everyone. Pick genre. I feel like I want a horror game as a genre. But I don't think. I guess that's not a thing. Space adventure. Space action. Hmm. I don't think it's be a good casual game. Strategy, think about it. Uh, yeah, that'd be like StarCraft. <laughs> Pick a platform, PC. Strategy games are better on PC. Super time. There you go. <clears throat> this will go well. Let's go with that. 3D graphics, of course. Alright. Strategy. I don't think store is important. Gameplay is probably very important. Engine's also very important. Oh, I forgot to make it a medium game. Gosh dang it. <sighs> Simple cutscenes, better user experience. Why not? Dang it, I forgot to make it a medium game. That's okay. What is this? <laughs> Time and space the game. Oh, oh look, they're looking at my current game. What the heck is going on? Okay, I don't know what that means, to be honest. <laughs> we had 80,000 people visiting our booth. We didn't make it to the top 100 booths this year. Once we gain more fans, I'm sure we will. Okay, yeah, sure. Okay, what is it? This is this guy from Electric Games, <laughs> Electric Arts, and I got word that her game is working on a new game. Would you be willing to share some information on current game project and do an interview? Sure. Readers are curious about what is soon going to make a video game and how come these prioritize development errors. New game is Space Strategy. Can you tell us whether such a 
game would usually receive more focus on dialogues or on gameplay. Gameplay. Thank you for your time. <coughs> I think that's true. There's a, we discussed and asked the company how different development areas are prioritized in the interview. Three and said that gameplay is of particular importance for such a game, and it seems that other industry professionals agree. Every game development project has limited resources, so it's very important to use the time most effectively. Dialogues. Okay, we just said gameplay was more important. So, artificial intelligence, level design, boom. Okay, see, we're all working on everything. Oh, look, it changed. Today, Valny has announced their very own console called the Play System. Apparently, the company has completely reworked their earlier play system to work prototype after <laughs> the cancel of the project. We play system with a CD-ROM 32-bit processor and it's fully owned by Boney. And the video declined to comment that places him willing to the market in two months. And now it's the play system 4. I wonder if that's in this game. Uh, sequels? Ooh. Ooh, la la. World design, graphics, sound, mono sound, open world. Yes. Duh. Okay. <clears throat> um, I wanted to do, but we might as well all focus on it. Not. Nah. Look at that hype, though. Uh, marketing. Let's do magazines and demos. Man, this is hyped up game right here. Seems the market has no laws again. Okay. It was for strategy. I'll get up to 70. Oh, wow, look at that. <clears throat> I better make some money off this. Oh, okay, I need to get, get cracking on that. Fix that bug, please. Okay, there we go, we're ready to go. That's some good design right there. This is an addictive game, holy cow, I can't quit playing it. <laughs> I need to go to bed so bad, it's like 240. It's so fun. I don't even know how to save. Oh my gosh, if I don't save my game, I'm gonna be pissed off. Levels? I'll be gaining a level after the next game, probably. Release game. What if you trash the game after all that money? The first reviews for our new release game, the Tame and Spice. Tame and Spice? Tin. Uh oh. On. Oh, it's unexpected. Oh, look! There's a two difference right there. Star Games is just haters. Not enough stars in my space game, I guess. <laughs> Okay, so I'll probably get, what, a 8.5 or something like that? That's a little more difficult math. Just an 8? Screw you, too. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's get a uh, game report from you. Let's get some research going on from you. Sequels. Let's get you doing some <clears throat> topics. I don't really want the topic of school, but does that mean like an educational game? That's a horrible idea. <laughs> okay, so we might as well raise this guy's technology more. He's the technology guy. Raise him more. There you go. We need to get a contract because uh, <clears throat> we need uh, more money. Post analysis. Space and strategy are great. Engine seems to be quite important for this type of game. Mm. I might not have made my engine important enough. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I did or not. It's not selling that well either, though. It's a bad deal. Some people might disagree. Develop a sequel! <gasps> I can make a sequel to that one game. That was really successful. Yeah. We should do that right now. Let's get up to 200k if we can. <clears throat> we have like something really cool. Time tracking? Sure. Oh, oh my gosh, look at that. Let's do it. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get slaughtered by this, fools. Oh no. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, jeez. Gotta make that my. My gosh, people, somebody needs to be fired. Should one table really have 200 columns? Probably not. Okay. We can do this. I believe in us. Okay, that did not do very well. I need to do better next time. 
Obviously, nobody cares about the space or strategy. Come on, guys, put some work into this contract. My gosh, it's going too slow. Okay, research is going up. Why you suck? Okay. Please, made some of my mind back. It's okay. Um, just research history. Seriously. Uh, jeez. Game tutorials. All right. There you go. I don't know what that will fall under, though. Staff this. Fine publishing deal. Let's see if we can get a good publishing deal going on. Mystery. Um, ninja. Alright, we'll go. Wait, we're not. She's not even researching that right now. Okay, so I think that's part of the engine. Oh, oh, yeah, it is. Well, we don't have enough money to develop another game engine right now, so. Contract work. No, nope, not that. Um, I should make a, I should make a sequel. <clears throat> um, where's that? Links of Sleepening? Dude, let's just make it. Uh, what was it for? Sorry. Dang it. Links of Sleepening. It have to be the same genre and everything, right? Surely it does. Surely you can't change that. I would think you can change that. Or it wouldn't be very sequely. Action. Fantasy Adventure Game Boy. It could be a different console. Okay, so you have to keep those. I'm sure. Uh oh. I'm gonna put it back on the game link. I should probably put it on the PlayStation. But I can't do that. Sorry. There we go. Um, let's make it for everyone. Let's go. Um. I already did Oracle of Seasons. I didn't know that this was going to happen, guys, okay? Oracle of Years. That one was a little more easy than the Seasons one. Let's make it a medium game. Spend some good money on this one. Super time. Next. I feel like it needs to be 2D almost. Because it's a... Yeah, it does. It does. Sorry, guys. It's higher quality 2D than the 3D, probably. So anyway. Okay. Story is very important. This is least important. Gameplay not so important. So whoever is best at design, Lucy Broadshaw seems to be the pro at design. Gameplay. That's all. That's all you. you know what? That's all me. I'll work on the gameplay. <laughs> Man, look, I actually have people who aren't too bad at stuff. Um, I think gameplay is even less important than that. There we go. Linear story, yes. Simple cutscenes, save game, better user experience. Okay, sure. What's wrong? Oh, I need a staff for the engine. Might as well put him there because he's technology. Let's go ahead and put it in magazines, man. Might as well. It's a sequel to a great game. Jeez. Hype it up. Jeez. No. I like the blackboard that never changes magically. It's quite majestic in that way. Um, artificial intelligence, not so important. Um, so, level design. I need to work on level design. Dialogues. Can be you. Artificial intelligence can be you. Okay, better dialogues. Yeah, sure. I'm probably clicking all those things all the time. Probably is unnecessary, but I like to do it anyway. I'm gonna run out of money soon. This will be bad to do. I guess you can do like lots of uh, more <clears throat> external publishing and stuff when that kind of stuff happens. You know, when you're running out of money. You get other people spending money for you. Sound level. Let's just do. Okay, let's just leave that. Leave that. I feel like the world design is pretty important, so. Let's see. Let's go there. Who has lots of design left? He's the only one with design, really, in him. These two are drained. Graphics. 
I mean, he's got the lowest design, but I think graphics is more technological in the way, I would think, personally. Um, so I'll put me on, oh, actually, looks like I can put him on sound and graphics. There we go. <clears throat> Have him doing two things. He's working hard. Market particularly well to games with new topics at the moment. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Don't know what that's supposed to be. Okay, I'll wait till uh, it's all bugged out and I'm gonna do some big marketing for this medium sized game. Alright, it's a sequel, guys. It's gotta be a big deal, right? I hope. <laughs> Not. Nah. We're screwed. Boom, hyped it up, boys. The two monsters via gear. Aw, oh, so sad. Oh, look at that technology and design in there. More design. Uh, all I can afford is a small booth this time around, unfortunately. I don't want to go bankrupt over my E3 booth. Uh, I'm gonna have to finish it. My hype is going down. Good management. Why good management? Because oh, because no one was full. I guess. I guess that's why. Oh yeah, leveling up everywhere. I like that chime. I think it automatically stops going. No, that's probably not true. You know what I was about to say. Character progression, day night cycle. Interesting. Oh, reviews. That'll have to be it for me for today. Hope you guys are enjoying, and I will see you next time on Game Dev Tycoon.